It could definitely be easier to have a, a normal job, but I don't know. I never felt as satisfied as um, working outside with the dogs. I would definitely say it's a hard job. I was just looking for places to stay while traveling and then uh, yeah, I got here and everyone was asking, oh, so you're the new dog handler? And I was like, wait, no, I'm just feeding the dogs. And then I, I learned that this is actually something you do, it's uh, work. I always thought I was more the person for warm weather, like I've been surfing in Central America and grew up in Africa, so for me the cold was like, oh fuck, how is that gonna be for me? It's just yeah, putting on some right clothes and getting used to it. Sure, there are cold days where you're like, man, I could have also been laying on the beach somewhere, but then you have the scenery in front of you with the snow-covered mountains and, and the dogs in front of you, and then you forget about the cold a little bit. You really see the difference, the energy of the dogs. If it's a really cold day, like minus 15, 20, then they're like super energetic. The view up on Alovado, I'm all the time stunning when I'm up there, so that's definitely one of my favorite tours that we're doing here. Yeah. Since I was a baby, we always had dogs around. Yeah, one or two dogs, that's, that's something else than having 50 dogs around and then um, Feeling the power and energy of them getting crazy or barking or howling, that's, yeah, that's different. But I love that feeling, like the super exciting harnessing and then as soon as you go it's quiet and um, you just enjoy being outside. It's like an intense contrast that you get. If you feel that you couldn't deny that all of them are super excited to be harnessed and then go. You're kind of in the middle of nowhere. But then, luckily, there's now some friends and we have a second dog handler, so that helps to like have company. But it's still, you still feel lonely. That's maybe a downside, I would definitely say. It's hard to meet people up here. Even though I managed to meet my girlfriend last year up here, but uh, yeah, it was great. This spring, when I was saying goodbye, I was uh, getting quite emotional because I thought it was the last time I'm going to see them in a long time. And when you went out in the mountains, you went through quite a few things, like some snowstorms or tricky situations. So you kind of build up connections to each of them and you start to realize that all of them have different characters and everyone has their own mind. It's not always fun, like the dogs are giving you a reward, yeah. so at the end it hey. becomes good. Yeah. I'm exhausted but happy and um, fall quick asleep, so it makes me happy to work with them. Mm.